This is a lesson for the law of signs. Objectives for this lesson is solve triangles by using the law of signs if the measures of two angles and a side are given. The second objective is find the area of a triangle if the measures of two sides and the included angle or the measures of two angles and a side are given. So for an introduction, um, the law of signs can be used to solve non-right triangles. And the formula for the law of signs is A over sine A equals B over sine B, which equals C over sine C. These equations state that the ratio of the length of any side is a constant for a given triangle. First example looks something like this. So we have three or we have two angles at 30 degrees, 45 degrees, and that's all they're giving us. And the side length for what would be C is two. So your first step is because all triangles equal 180 degrees, you do 180 minus 45 degrees minus 30 degrees equals 105. That is your missing degree for this triangle. Your next step is you plug it into this formula. So what you would do is you would do sine of 30 degrees over two equals sine of 105 degrees over A, which equals sine of 45 degrees over B. So your next step is simplify. So this sine of 30 degrees, if plugged into a calculator or on the unit circle equals one half. Sine of 30 degrees equals one half, as you can see. So you cross this out and you put a one half. Your next step is your one half over two equals one fourth. So then your one fourth equals sine of 105 degrees over A. So for your next step, you use the reciprocal of one fourth, which is four, and you plug it in to the to this here. So it's four sine 105 degrees equals A. So then you plug that into a calculator. So four sine 105 equals 3.863. So that's your side length for A. 3.8 which you can round up and that's units. Your second part of this is finding angle measure B. So for B, you do the same thing, but instead you use your side B length, which is sine 45 over B. So sine 45 over B. Um, the sine of 45 is root two over two from the unit circle. So then you'll go with the reciprocal, reciprocal of one fourth again. It'd be one fourth equals B over root two over two. So now you go four times root two over two using the reciprocal equals root two over two. And that plugged into a calculator your side length for B equals 2.83. So that's how you find your unknown side lengths to a triangle using the law of sines. For the next example, 
um, we're going to find the area of a triangle using the law of sines. So your first step, let me get this triangle written down here, is you get, you have your two side lengths and your one angle measure. So your first step is you use the formula, which is K equals one half AC, which is your side lengths, sine B. Then you go to your second step, which is just plug your side lengths in and your degree in. So K equals one half 4.7 times 12.4 equals sine 47 degrees 20 feet. Your K value for this is K equals 21.43 units. So then that, you plug that in. You don't plug it in, but as an area, your area equals 21.43 units squared after rounding it, and that's the answer to your question.